What's going on guys? I have Nagami Chigami and welcome back to my merch unboxing series. A little series I'm doing of just random brands I like. Uh, so far I've gotten fast food stuff so like McDonald's, Chick-fil-A, uh, In-N-Out. Those are already on the channel. And then other than that I do a bunch of video game unboxing which are probably still yet to come. Or by the time this video goes up, I'll probably have a bunch of those up. Large backlog. But yeah, as you can see, Trailer Park Boys is today's theme. I'm already wearing John Dunsworth's sunglasses with the Jim Leahy signature on them. So that's fire. I'm gonna put these to the side right now. So rest in peace to John Dunsworth, Jim Leahy, my guy. So I did get this. I guess I'll just make this first on the list because it's unopened and I'm gonna keep it that way. But it's the Trailer Park Boys Christmas Special, the yeah, Xmas Special it says. But it comes with the Conky Puppet, which is why I wanted it. So that's pretty fire. I'm glad I got it for a good price and it was still sealed, so. Well, actually it's kind of sad it's still sealed because I can't mess around with the Conky Puppet, but it's also like, when am I really gonna do that? Conky Puppet. This. This I bought on eBay, cause I saw it on Amazon and they had one more, they had like a few left of the Ricky shirt, but Amazon only had smalls left, I realized. All these were sold out cause everyone wants a Ricky shirt. Is that nice like, a uh, fake silky type of thing, kind of bouncy material, but I think I'm just putting it. I got this on eBay for 16 and a half dollars. Can you believe that? People are selling that, and this is extra large, like the size I need. So just, just to have the extra rickiness, but yeah, oh yeah. I'm wearing the I am liquor shirt to go with my glasses. So we're outside. Hound's Tooth Ricky shirt. Speaking of Ricky shirts, this one I also got off the Amazon because they opened up the store. Um, probably at the start of the video and I said this was a Trailer Park Boys merch unboxing. I put up like the merch stores they have, but they used to have a couple and now they have a bunch as well. Like partners that they do stuff with. They have an Amazon store now. Uh, but yeah, this one I got off the Amazon store. It's the official Ricky Sunnyvale jersey. So it's jersey material. What does this say? Trailer Park Boys fucking decent merch. That's what's up. Ricky 420. Cham Pro Performance Comfort Durability, bro. Our team builds yours. That's crazy. That's pretty nice. I'm not going to put this on now, but you know. Ricky 420, bro. That's what's up. Um, all right, let's get into this bag next, just because I messed up the way I was going to do this situation. You know what? I'm going to just fast forward me, like, making the situation I wanted to have set up. All right, next situation. Trailer Park Boys bag. I'm pretty sure this was supposed to come with the complete like seasons collection, but I got this for cheap, like 10 bucks eBay, just the bag. Cause I was like, yeah, cool. But what's in the bag is what's interesting here. So I had most of it, but I left some of it out. The first partnership we're going to look at that's not clothes and this stuff is Hamptown Naturals. Very exciting. Very exciting. So yes, let me put all of these out here. These are, in fact, Trailer Park Boys weed products. That's crazy. So they have edibles and drink enhancers. The three flavors of the edibles are, like, you know, Bubbles Green Bastards, Julian's Rum and Cola, and then Ricky's Orangey for the edibles. I already tried <laughs> Julian's Rum and Cola for the edibles and then for the drink enhancers. It's a blue raspberry for bubbles. Julian still has Rum and Cola. And then Ricky has Blood Orange instead of Orangey, like his fish on the 
those. But yeah, with the edibles, it says there's 10 per pack. It was 10 rum and cola flavored gummies. There was 15 in them. So that's pretty cool. I don't know if that's like a funny Ricky thing, like how they say they're gonna have 10 in it, but there's extra, cause it's like a Ricky dose or cause Ricky forgets or whatever. But I'm happy. I don't know if I can feel through this to see how many there are, but hopefully there's 15 in these as well. We'll try out these flavors eventually, but yeah. Very interesting, I would say. They had CBD slash CBG, like cigarettes, with just like CBD in them as well, with Trailer Park Boys. I wanted them, for some reason, they don't ship to certain states, just the CBD stuff, even though these have CBD in them along with Delta 9, so that's whack. But uh, yeah, I got what I could, and I'm pretty happy with it. It's still kind of expensive, so I, yeah, you know. But for one-time purchase, it's cool. Next partnership, Coney Island Saucery, Green Bastard Verde Hot Sauce. And then uh, Coney Island Saucery gave me stickers. Or one sticker, the recipient. get into the next bottle so Julian doesn't have a sauce I'm pretty sure but bubbles had green bastard and he had like a fucking decent hot sauce but that's sold out everywhere so I have Ricky smokes let's go hot sauce and bubbles green bastard hot sauce which is all I could get by with so far but I did get the Bubbles decent hot sauce shirt instead to go with it. The Coney Island Saucery logo on the back, but it's the it's the boys, it's the homies on this shirt. You know, speaking of shirts, I was gonna get the shirt that says like uh, Ricky, Julian, Bubbles, Randy, and Lady from their merch on like Amazon, but. You know, it's like 30 bucks for that shirt. I could like make that myself. That's how I felt about this jersey too. But it was like fine, a pretty good deal. So whatever. But yeah, enough of uh, the food stuffs. Let me put these things away. Put them away. Let's get on to this. This is very hard to find. People are selling it for 300, 400 bucks. This is insane. And all of them have like rip stickers. I got this one without rip stickers for like 150 Canadian. So that's like 100 US. So I was like, fine, cool. Even the Dunsworth glasses, people are selling for like 300, 200 bucks. I'm glad I got those for way cheaper. But I don't know. I'm glad this was protected because of how, like, basically every other one that's being sold online does have, like, messed up jank stickers. Like, none of them look like they were kept well, or they look like someone was trying to peel off the sticker or something and put it on something else. But, you know, it's cool and all when you buy that, for yourself do a lot of stuff, but is reselling that in the play. So I don't know why the back has a, like the back when it gets pulled off, it still has like stuff on the box. So I think this was like a promo extra flyer or whatever, but that works out for me. I can stick that up somewhere. But there it is, Randy's gut. The Cheeseburger Locker. The Complete Collection Trailer Park Boys Official Cheeseburger Locker. The greasiest collection ever. Warning contains language some may find fucking offensive. Got the homeboy Ricky, homeboy Julian, homeboy Bubbles. Every episode, every TV special, and both movies. This is still before swearing at days. 
Oh no, some parts of it are peeling off. It is pretty old, so I'm not surprised. But hey, would you look at that? All of this is cling wrap as well for its safety. That's what's up. Pretty fire. I'm gonna just leave it the way it is for now for its safety. But that's a nice addition to the collection. For real, for real. Last partnership. This one's with High Roller Games. The gamers do be rolling pretty highly, apparently. We're outside. Let's open up this package and see what's inside. I don't really remember what it is I got from here. Oh. Charlotte Park Boys Opoly. This looks like it would be pretty fun. The Sunnyvale edition. So it's Trailer Park Boys Monopoly, basically. So yeah, stuff it bundle. Three set bundle, Trailer Park Boys collectible money, and then the Sunnyvale edition of this. So I guess I got that. I think I got your Trailer Park Boy money. So I'll get to that in a second. It's like fake Trailer Park Boys money. See what's in the, I don't know why they put a package inside a package, but that's cool. So yeah, here's the Supply and Command card game. Trail Park Boys playing cards. Trail Park Boys rolling papers. That's funny. So yeah, let's get to the money though. What exactly is in this? It said it was supposed to be Three new board game coming in 2024 cheeseburger liquor run. I saw that, but I was like, no, I'm not like paying that much for like extra random Trailer Park Boys games, but that's fine. Let's see the envelope, the Trailer Park Boys Sunnyville money. So I'm supposed to have three sets of this: one, two, five, ten, twenty. 50, 100, 1, 2, 5, 10, 20, 50, 100. So yeah, there are three sets. It's just, there's like only one bill per thing. So I'll, I'll do this one in a row. So it's one, $1. There's Corey and Trevor on the front and back. Right on dude, I'll come with you. On Sunnyville buck right there. Next, we have two dollars. Randy, it's got a cheeseburger on. That's helpful. <laughs> He's in the back. A man's gotta eat. He right, Randy. Double cheeseburger money. Good, good. Bank of Sunnyville. It is Leahy with a liquor bottle. I am the liquor. Five dollar. What do you got? It's him drinking in front of a car, drinking and driving. He the OG, repping the, you know, freedom game. $10, we got bubbles with a Puma cat. Like a large kitten, bro. If you love something, set it free for real. $10, we got bubbles. And we got bubbles standing at the entrance for his shed. Pretty chill, pretty chill. This money's pretty, I thought it would come with a bunch of like, shitty looking, like fake money, but each one, it only comes with like one of each bill, but it's actually like nice money, like professional money. 20 is Ricky, look at that, it's got weed, get two birds stoned at once, oh god. It's him riding a bike. I like all these zoomed in on, hopefully. $50, it's Julian with his, with his glass of rum. I got a plan, all right, it's called Freedom 35. Oh god, and his picture is him standing in front of his whip, or next to his whip, passing the door, I think, as usual, here. <laughs> so, now the hundred dollar bill, you may be wondering what is going to be on this one. It is Sunnyvale's trailer park sign, Freedom 45 question mark, and it's all three of the boys, that's right, we got everyone, Freedom 45 per chance. That. that is pretty fire actually 
I'm not unhappy. I'm glad I got three. The three pack. So I recommend you do that too. It's not, it doesn't cost that much more. And, uh, you get a good amount of the So yeah. You can read the descriptions of all the games online. It's pretty good. We got all of this stuff. We got Trailer Park Boys weed. We got wrapping papers. We got hot sauce. We got a bunch of clothes. We got Monopoly. We got the disc sets. And I got the glasses, bro. Overall, I would say I'm pretty happy with this collection of Trailer Park Boy stuff. And yeah, uh, I recently collected all of this because I just finished watching like the entire series again. I think this is the third time I've seen the whole, like just the Netflix show, or like just everything on Netflix, just the show. Like seasons one through like a eight or nine. And then this is the second time I've seen like seasons one through 12 all the way through like everything including like the movies and swear net stuff and this is the first time i've also seen like the black and white film and then i've also i just saw like a um, what was it called uh, i forgot it's like the last one i'll put it on the screen but yeah it's a 1998 or 1999 film by mike clattenberg with the uh, ricky and julian's actors um, like Rob Wells and uh, what is it? J.P. Morgan Chase, bro. What's his name? <laughs> John Paul Tremblay, Tremblay, and then of course John Dunsworth as uh, you know Gary Williams is boss. Let's go check that old one out too. It's actually on Netflix. So yeah, shout out Trailer Park Boys gang guys. Uh, subscribe to SwearNet. I'll put links to all of these partnerships and stuff in the description. And uh, yeah, shout out the boys, Rip Leahy. I'm Swayze.